In the 16th century, every major Protestant thinker taught that cr the nature of Christ's presence in the Eucharist was an issue that was determinative for salvation. If you got that wrong, you went to hell. Luther thought that. Calvin thought that. Zwingli thought that. They all thought it. And yet they all disagreed on what the nature of Christ's presence in the Eucharist was. Now, my point here is not that they disagreed about the Eucharist. It was this. All of them said you had to get the Eucharist right or you were going to hell. Today, almost no evangelical Protestant would say that. So it's not just a question about Christ's presence in the Eucharist. It's a question about how do you know what counts as a dogma? How do you know what pertains to salvation? How do you know what's central? How do you know what's essential in the Christian faith? The Bible itself cannot, does not, will not answer that question for you. You've got to have the authority of the Catholic Church to answer that question.